Good evening, Snappers. Well, here we are. It's Nationals Eve. Only one more sleep to go until the biggest run, jump, chuck carnival in Australia this year. And to mark the occasion, we're going to do something very special, something we've never done on the Mossy and Robbo Snapchat channel before. That's right, we're going to bring in a very special cameo appearance from one of the stars of the Chucks here in Australia. Drum roll, please. Please put your hands together for the great Matt Denny. Now, Matty, before we go any further, I want you to tell the kids, mate, a little bit about yourself, where you're from, what you do, and what you chuck. Ah, oh, hey, how you going? Welcome to the show, fellas. Yeah, my name's Matt Denny, and I throw things a long way. Um... Seriously, thanks for Mossy and Robo for bringing me on the Snapchat show. Um, yeah, so my events are Disc and Hammer, and um, I'm competing on Friday, Saturday. I'm actually from a small town called Allera, which is in Queensland, um, in the sticks sort of thing. I have my own circle at home and my own gym and stuff, so it's a bit remote. After grades 6 and 7 coming last at States, I got a coach and trained hard, and I'm sort of at where I am at the moment, so... Uh, Mr. Matt Denny, thanks very much for joining us on Mossy and Robbo's Snapchat. Uh, mate, just want to know, what's your nickname and also your favourite pump-up tune? Usually it's just Denny between everyone that I know. Um, I also occasionally get Thor and Big D, hence the reason for Big D 8270, but it's not supposed to be inappropriate. My favourite pump-up song would probably be um, Ultimate by Denzel Curry. I love 1980 to 1990 R&B and just hip-hop stuff, but um, it varies. Names though, try and keep it to Denny or Thor. I don't. I like Thor actually more than anything because it sort of suits with the hammer and stuff. But the other one's sort of a bit left field. Hello, Denny. A question here from one of your fans, Prada. She says, "What's your favourite food? And in addition, what's your favourite pre-game meal?" Thanks, Prada, for the question. So kebabs, no brainer. Uh, for pre-comp, it's sort of really anything that gives me energy. Um, I have to stick away from pasta. A bit. So I try and stick away from pasta because I find it makes me a bit drowsy, but I sort of try and eat a lot of chicken, protein, good veggies, all that sort of thing, and just eat a lot and get a lot of energy. Good morning, Thor. Big D or just plain Denny? We have three questions to go, two of them from your fans. This one from Dusty. What's your pre-competition ritual? Everyone, welcome back. So pre-comp ritual is getting my hair cut the day before competition and same with having a massive feed the day before as well. When it comes to in competition, I usually have like a selective hat um, that I wear and also just the same way I walk into the circle every time. Can't wait to see the selective hat this weekend. The next question is from Mitchell. How's your training been going? So tell us where do you train, who do you train with and what do you do? Thanks Mitchell for the question. Um, training's been going very well actually. Um, hammer's been not as great, but discus has been going very well, so hopefully put it together this weekend. I um, train in Toowoomba, but like it varies between at home and in Toowoomba, but uh, my coach is Graham Pitt and I, we have a big squad. So The people I train with, there's a lot of them, so um, it's sort of hard to name everyone, but mostly everyone in our group is in the top five in the country for their event, which is mainly throws. So. Final question, what's your dream competition? So you can have a chuck with any person, past or present, in any location. Who would it be with and where would it be? Okay, so for competition venue for that would be in Eugene, Oregon. Um, I've loved that circle and it's such a good setup with winds and all that sort of thing. When comes to the person, um, would be Mac Wilkins. He's top 10 in history for discus and he's one of my technical models and stuff, but such a great thrower of history. So, Hammer though, um, I'd probably like to throw in Barcelona, the Olympic Stadium, which is crazy, and the world record holder for Hammer, who's um, another technical model. Matt Denny, thanks so much for joining us on Mossy and Robbo's Snapchat. Ask Denny, uh, just tell us, mate, uh, where can we follow you on different social media channels? Hey, guys, thanks for um, asking me on the new Snapchat show. I think it's a great idea, and I think it's worked very, very well. Um, I hope people have really enjoyed it. When it comes to following me, um, I have Snapchat, YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook, two Facebooks, in, um, athlete page, and normal account. Thanks guys for watching, hopefully you enjoyed it. Please support Mossy and Robbo during the Olympic trials as they cover it. Um, hope to see you out at the track. Well there you go folks, huge thanks to the Big D, Matt Denny, for taking the time out to answer the questions on Snap. Make sure you follow the Big D on Snapchat right here. 
And good luck, mate, with all your chucking coming up at Nationals, in particular the discus, where we want to see you rip one out over 65 metres for a big PB and Olympic qualifier. And a big thanks to you guys for tuning in to the first ever Mossy and Robbo Snapping with the Stars. Stay tuned to the next episode. We're going to introduce you to a man known as the White Tiger. But for now, that's a wrap, and we'll see you in Run Jump Chuckland.